Great job, Ace. We have earned another chance to show what we can do. This time with Ema. All right, Ace. Thanks to that little scrap you and Aaron got yourselves into with the Varaxo, Uncle Anton wants me to make sure you know how to stay alive when the shooting starts. Your instincts served you well at Harlequin Station. It's evident you've learned something useful from all those space combat sims you're always playing. But now, it's for real. And you can't rely on just instincts and sim experiences. I guess the most important thing to remember is that a YT-1300 isn't a starfighter. For a transport, it is fast, light, and maneuverable. But you wouldn't want to take on an Imperial TIE fighter in it. The fact of the matter is, you're better off avoiding trouble in the first place, rather than trying to fight your way out after you've gotten into it. I'm going to run you through some simple targeting exercises, then we'll fly off to an old debris field. It'll be easier than shooting Minox off a power cable. I'll program some drones to lighten things up a bit. We will fly the Sabra again, with yours truly as pilot, and you occupying the gun turret. Elon will be flying the Andrasta, his personally customized Kuat Systems Engineering Fire Spray class patrol craft. We will use drones to help you familiarize yourself with the targeting and sensor systems and the associated displays available in the gun turret. As soon as you're ready, Iman will lead the way to a debris field where you can practice your gunnery skills. This is going to be great. All right, MK. Try not to hit anything in your way, I... Sir, my flight record is quite unblemished. I know. I'm just rousing you a little. Hope you're enjoying the ride in the gunner's turret, little brother. All right, MK. Park your ship above that rendezvous buoy. Demon will drop off a few drones while he explains. Target the drone. Then examine the CMD and sensor displays. The CMD identifies the target and displays critical target data. The sensor displays allow you to track all nearby objects. Wait a second to them! Just remember the bracketed dot is what you have targeted. The colors identify friend from foe, neutral and unknown. Purple is family, blue is neutral, presumed friendly. Very impressive! Red designates an Imperial vessel. Green is a rebel craft. Gold is any other aggressor or unknown that is presumed hostile. Keep it up! So what do you say? You and I just get straight to the shooting. Go ahead and shoot all the drones.
Not too shabby. You've demonstrated pretty decent gunnery skills in the good old YT-1300. I guess we can trust you with some of the riskier jobs that sometimes come our way. You might actually be useful the next time some stinking group of pirates tries to jump one of our ships. <laughs> 